Good evening, guys. I hope everyone's doing well. I hope everyone's bike is running smoothly. I want to share with you some discoveries I made recently. First, starting with uh, my filters, oil and filters. I go to Amazon for most of my stuff, and I wanted to try this 204C filter because it said on Amazon that it was made in USA. Well, it's not. It's made in Thailand. There it is, right, right there. So I should have sent it back because $18 for a oil filter, that's outrageous. Just because it has a little nut on the bottom of it, that's, which I don't need. So Amazon also sells a Wix filter for $10. This is the, this is the number right here. And I went on to Wix's website just to verify, and sure enough, it it fits the. Uh, I took all their information and downloaded it to this spreadsheet just to make it easier to see. But yeah, it fits this this particular filter, this fifty one three fifty eight, fits. Oh geez, about twenty thirty different triumphs. And the speed triple is right there, 2005, 2011, 1050 cc. And interestingly, this same filter fits all these other vehicles. And if you go, since I'm kind of a Mobile One oil and filter fan, but Mobile One doesn't have any motorcycles, they don't have a cross reference for motorcycles. However, all this, this Wix filter fits all these, everything in this green box here. So that's, wait, let's scroll down to the bottom here. It's 920 different vehicles. These vehicles also take the Mobile One. Uh, let's, let's switch over here. Uh, hang on, I'll get to that in a second. The Mobile One 108 and 110A, both of these filters. So by backdoor cross-referencing, if you if you will, the Triumph should take both of these filters. This one being a little longer, but a little bigger, so it would, it would stick out below the oil pan. You know the the 110A, but the 108 should fit fine and would probably be identical size to the to the Wix. And at 11, you know, 1144 and 1134 respectively and then the Wix, which I think is a is a good filter, certainly good enough. Not I don't I just don't think the the Canon is worth uh, worth almost double the price. Also, I didn't realize that Walmart sold sold the oil. Yeah, Mobile One Oil, because I've been buying it at O'Reilly's. So this particular quart, um, I paid twelve these I paid twelve dollars for, for this at O'Reilly's, but I noticed right now they have a sale for it and it's on nine ninety nine, so ten ten bucks for a quart. But and Walmart's selling it for ten eighty six, so I'll just go ahead and call it eleven dollars. But my fork change, oil fork change, which I'm going to get to. I know everyone's waiting for me to, I, I've been waiting for me to do it too. It's just such a, it takes so long filming it, trying to get it on film and then trying to do the job. It just, it makes everything taste twi takes twice as long as normal. So anyway, in the process of getting ready, I was getting ready to do this. I was checking my engine oil and noticed it was a little, seemed a little dirty for, for only having a over a little over a thousand miles on it, maybe 1300 miles. I'm not, I don't know exactly. So I thought I would just go ahead and change it just to, just to keep it super clean. And I thought if I'm going to be changing it that often, there's got to be a better, a cheaper oil out there than mobile one is kind of the top of the line. Supposedly, you can go 10,000 miles in between. I, I would never do that, but I found this Valvoline 
on Amazon also for nine bucks a quart. So three, two to three bucks less, depending on where you get your, your mobile one per quart. And a Wix filter. So if you were gonna if you were gonna do an oil change, say every three thousand miles, I would much rather change it more often and use a lower grade filter and oil than run a mobile one and a K and N for for five thousand miles. I think you're you're better off using cheaper oil and filter and just changing more often, keeping keeping it cleaner. That's my opinion anyway. Oh, another side note, XP. I, the reason I threw my, my John Deere stuff in here was uh, uh, just a, a side note about how they, they tell you on Amazon that, yeah, these are made in America. Well, actually, no, it's, it's made in Canada or Brazil. So this John Deere filter, which Amazon said was American, no, it's made in Brazil, so I could just well have gone with the Wix on that too, which at 750 versus 11. And one more thing about the Wix, if you notice there's Wix, the, the same exact number, but then it has an XP, an XP behind it. And I was reading some post from some Yahoo on the internet said that, oh yeah, XP just means extra performance. Same exact filter, just extra performance. Well, if you go to the Wix website, that is not the case. Because this particular, which, which one is this? It just so happens that, that these two Wix filters, this one for the Triumph and this one for my, for my lawn tractor, are only off by, you know, the 48 versus the 58. It's just, just a coincidence. But they both come in XPs also, and they fit totally different. It's not, it's not the same filter. It doesn't just mean extra performance. So don't listen to yahoos on the internet <laughs> like me. Uh, look, it up on, look it up on the Wix website yourself. If I can get to the end of this, this pink or whatever section or color you call this. Yeah, so the 51348, so this one that fits the John Deere, this 51348, it fits 2,000, 2,000 and, where is it, 2,000, 2,620 different, different implements, uh, tractors, trucks, Toyotas, Suzukis, Sterlings, Saabs, Plymouths, and the XP of the same number, this 51348 XP, it's good for some Dodges, some Fords, about 400, 400 vehicles, Yugo. So it's, it's, there's something different about that, that filter. It, it's not the same filter. So when you're buying a Wix, don't, don't get the XP because it's there is no Wix XP filter that fits the Triumph. Only, only this one, the 51358. Ten bucks, Amazon. Good deal, good filter. They're ma this made in. Uh, it says it's made in North Carolina on, on this side of the box. Then it says something about when sold in Mexico on the bottom of the box. So I don't know where it's made, Mexico. North Carolina, whatever. I know that this KNN, which they said was made in America, is not. It's made in Taiwan. Or Thai, Thailand. I'm sorry, Thailand. So, there you have it. 